how to create and add a new user on Windows 11 without a Microsoft account. The first thing you need to do is navigate to your taskbar and right click on the Windows Start icon. Once done, left click on Settings. You'll now be in your system settings. In Settings, look for where it says Accounts and left click on Accounts. In your account settings, scroll down until you see where it says Other Users. Device access, work or school users, kiosk assigned access. To the right hand side of other users there's an arrow, click on this arrow. Inside other user settings you'll be able to add another user. To the right hand side of add other user you can see a button which says add account. Click on add account. Once you've done that a small window will open asking you how will this person sign in. Enter the email address or phone number of the person you want to add. If they use Windows, Office, Outlook.com, OneDrive, Skype or Xbox enter the email address or phone number they use to sign in. Now of course in this video guide we're not going to be adding a Microsoft account when adding other users to our Windows 11 PC. So what we need to do is look to where it says I don't have this person's sign in information and all we need to do is click on this hyperlink text. Once done Microsoft will prompt you to create a Microsoft account. Of course guys we don't want to do that. We in fact want to add a user without a Microsoft account. It's the very last option here. Simply click on this hyperlink text. You'll then be taken to create a user for this PC. There'll be three text boxes, one for you to pick a username and two more text boxes to choose a password and confirm that password you chose. Under who's going to use this PC, pick a username. So I'm going to call this user test123. And then underneath it says make it secure. I'll need to choose a password for test123. So I'm just going to enter in a password now. And underneath that, I'll need to re-enter my password to confirm my password. Underneath that, if I scroll down, there'll be security questions which you can add. You can pick your security question for each and add an answer if you want. So I'm going to choose three security questions and add an answer to each. So I'm going to click on the first security question box here. Because these are security questions, I'm going to blur these out for this video demonstration. Once you've added answers to all three security questions, click on next. The other user account that you just created for your Windows 11 PC will then be added. As you can see guys, we have a new other user called test123. It's a local account and if I click on this arrow here, you'll be able to adjust the account options. So if I click on change account type, you'll be able to see what the current account type is. As you can see, it's currently a standard user. If I click on this box here, you can change it to administrator if you want. And if you do indeed want this account type of administrator, just simply click on OK and then your other user will become an administrator account. If you now want to sign into your other user that you just created, all you need to do is navigate to your taskbar and left click on your Windows Start icon. Once you've done that, simply left click on your current user account and then you'll see all your other user accounts. As you can see, test123 is right here and if we want to change to this account, all we need to do is simply left click on this user account. I'm not going to do that guys as my video recording will cut out. However, if you do indeed click on your new user account, you'll be taken to your user accounts login page. All you need to do is enter in the password that you created for that account. You'll then be signed into that user account. And that pretty much concludes the video on how to create and add a new user on Windows 11 without a Microsoft account. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Wait, is it so